realistic key feel for the money that you have. Oh, hi. Well, I was just answering Johnny here about what graded hammer action meant and how he could get a digital piano that was going to feel like a piano and not like a keyboard. But I might just explain this to you as well. If you're in the market for a digital piano and you want it to feel more like a piano than a keyboard, then you need to know about the term graded hammer action and weighted keys. Those are two different terms that get used in with different models of digital pianos uh, and they mean slightly different things. Weighted keys means that every key on the keyboard or on the digital piano is given a semi-realistic weight of the feel of playing acoustic piano keys. However, weighted keys generally means that every key up and down the keyboard, whether it's at the bottom or at the top, has the exact same weight to it. And this isn't really so realistic. So when we go for graded hammer action, this means that two things, it's graded in terms of from low to the top, it's more realistic with the weight of each keys meaning that the weight of the keys at the bottom feel a bit heavier and the weight of the keys at the top feel slightly lighter. It also has this hammer action where it's not actually a hammer on the felt on the back of the keys as it is in a piano, but they're sort of using that idea um, with an actual hammer to create the digital sound. So it has more a lot more of a realistic sound and it gives you that more realistic bounce back on the keys. So, in a nutshell, if you're buying a new digital piano, try to go for weighted keys, fully weighted keys, or even if you can spring for it, the little bit extra, find a model that has the graded hammer action because that is going to give you the most realistic feel to a piano. If you are wanting to perform on a piano or uh, do exams or recitals or anything like that, on a natural piano at some point, then you're going to want to practice on a digital piano that where the difference between the two is minimal. But if you just want to play some keys and just have fun with it and not worry too much about technique or performing on an acoustic piano at any point, then you can also just get a keyboard and just play around with that for the time being. If your budget doesn't allow a great hammer action digital piano, you can still learn a lot of piano and learn incredible things about music theory and being creative and riffing and composing without needing to have a full-length 88 keyboard with graded hammer action. Better get back to work. So that's that.